Okay, so you're getting ready to present to an audience with speaker support, and you're nervous. The last thing you need to be doing is futzing around trying to find the show button at the bottom of the screen. Click on the wrong one and it can really throw you for a loop. Been there, done that. Here's a little known trick to avoid the problem altogether. If you're using PowerPoint, save your file as a show file. Then when you open it, it will automatically open in full screen mode and you're ready to go. But put a black slide in as the first slide. Then after it opens, advance it to your title screen when you're ready. For Keynote, same thing. But you need to set this up in the Document Inspector. Just click on Automatically Play upon Open. But let's go one step further. If you're presenting using a projector, consider having your computer set up in dual screen mode. That's the opposite of mirroring. That way, if you use PowerPoint, you can use Presenter View. This gives you a full screen image on the main stage screen, but here's what you see on your computer the slide you're on and the slide before and behind it. You can also view notes on the slide that's active. On the keynote side, it's much the same and somewhat customizable. But what these two views do is keep you one step ahead. You can always see the next slide so you know where you're going. And knowing where you're going in front of an audience, well, <laughs> that's a good thing. <laughs>